Greetings, this is Gintian, and we are playing on the Kingdom Chronicles server. Yeah, you thought I forgot it, didn't you? As I'm logging on today, I am starting to work on this project. And the first thing that had to happen was the wall behind me had to come down the wooden wall because I need lots of wood for this project. And as I'm looking in front of me, I immediately noticed we've got visitors. So while I take care of these, let me tell you about why I do this. The main reason I make YouTube content is I want to help you master Minecraft so you can enjoy watching and playing Minecraft anywhere. If this is your first time on my channel and you want to get the most... Okay, I had to log off real quick. Real life interfered with my recording, which sometimes happens. And... Just like that. So I'm back on. It's now nighttime, and I need to go over here, back up, and go to bed. And there's still more out there. So let's go back to getting rid of these guys. If this is your first time on my channel and you want to get the most out of your Minecraft experience, make sure to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell so you know when I produce videos. Okay, I'm back, and let me show you what else I've started building here. If I go look, there's all my resources. This is going to be a filter system. No reason why this is like this. Going across this way, and then across, and then there'll be a row going this way. So it'll be a big U, and it should allow me to filter out all my items and more importantly it will also filter items that I will be pulling from that direction so you know that's what I'm doing so far this is gonna be a long process it tells me that immediately I'm going to need a lot of chests you need chests to build these hoppers and of course you need chests all the storage so I'm probably gonna end up planting some trees over here on a short-term basis for the purposes of getting wood okay if you remember the bee project I had to plant a lot of these birch trees in order to get the hives and that means I have this Lots of birch logs. Hadn't thought about this, but this makes goes a long ways towards solving my wood problem. I'll see you in a minute. I just got killed by an Enderman of all things, and had a run in with two creepers. And they took out everything. So I need to get this rebuilt as fast as possible. And the 
lag is horrible. So, let me go about fixing all this, and I'll be back with another update. Okay, I am back, and if you look at my inventory now, I have a lot of chests. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, approximately seven stacks, and I have 34 hoppers. So, time to get back to work placing chests. Hello, I am back, and I want to show you the progress that has been made on this large storage system. Let's take a look. So, I have gone all the way around, added lights above it, and now I'm working on building the staircase that goes downward, and then I'll expand these chests downward as well. But this is what I've got so far. And I will update you in a little bit after I make a little more progress. Welcome back, and I am planting some trees because I am out of wood. I just went on traveling across the land and captured a bunch of trees, chopped down a bunch of trees, and so I have the 47 saplings which I am now planting and hopefully that will allow me give me small enough trees that I won't be too hard to chop down and such but let me show you what progress I've made another skeleton and of course I can't get in. So, here's me flying. Which, yes, as you might imagine, just gives me so many more ways to die. Perfect landing. And here we are. So far, we've got the walkway to take us out, and we can reach all of the chests. Chests go all the way down, and the stairs go all the way down, and I'm just going to level it off here. We don't need to go any lower. Because as it is, this makes the chests low enough that you can still reach all of them. See, I can reach the top one. So, that's how we stand. I'm back again, and I have planted all of the trees. The reason I spaced them out so much is so that they wouldn't run into each other and accidentally get a extra large tree. Those are much harder to uh, uh, chop down so with these smaller trees I can just go out here and chop them down and then the whole tree is gone and the leaves will just decay and of course I can go, go plant a new tree here this will give me the wood I need to make all the chests and as well as making the hoppers. I went and purchased a lot of iron from Looney and that should help me make the hoppers. So again, I will come back with an update. Welcome back. I am here collecting. I just harvested a large fir tree. Those are the last leaves that are despawning now. So I've got one, two, three, four and a half. 
stacks of spruce logs. And some weird things going on over right here. I think my villagers called a whole lot of iron golems. I got this weird guy who got up there. I don't even know how he got up there. If these guys are far enough away, they don't seem to know who killed them. Although now he's running towards them. Nope. I wonder why I keep Let's not shoot him, he's too close. Too close to me. That's what it boils down to. As long as they don't defend each other, I'm good! Ugh. An iron golem walked in front of me and I hit him. He immediately killed me. So let me gather up my stuff. coming from the priests inside here, drinking their potions. So I want to try and kill these guys. You might ask why, because more or less I just want the iron. Thankfully, he can't take apart the... I just used up all my arrows. That was the wrong bow. Oh my goodness. That's just, this is the bow I wanted to use. It has infinity and fire. This one, it was just a bow I had in my inventory. Damn those skeletons. So these guys are now absolutely waiting for me. If I get down now, I'm toast. Can I go up? Okay, we go up and we go across here and we can escape from the iron golems. Fantastic. See, and if I use this one. Oh, I have no arrows. I still can't shoot, dummy. If you don't have arrows, you can't shoot. Now. I know if all else fails, I know where to get some arrows. And the best way to do is to fly there. Which I could have flown away, couldn't I? How's that for... I, well, I could have flown away, what can I say? Just not 
thinking this through. Let's see if I can land. Turning around seems to get you to softly land. See, all I need is a couple arrows. I've made on the giant storage system. And I come back up here. And I got a head. Literally a head. So I need to drop something in order to I'm gonna drop the flowers to get the head. This is a iron golem's head. Which is kinda cool. working on my structure, my storage system, and I will get back to you in a moment for the next update. Hello, I am back and I am on my way to the nether because I need to get My weapons fixed and so that's what I'm here to do and here we are so let me get my sword and let's see I need a chest I will put there, put some of these items in here so I'll have stuff room in my inventory. And then I can take my armor off. And then I can start killing Endermen. to give you an update on what's been going on. Big reveal. This is my storage system. It's all in place. You can reach the top. If you want the ones down the bottom, you just go down to the ground floor. If we take a look at the top, this is a filter system. So once I put the filter items into these hoppers, this system will filter and I can put my inventory in one end and it will filter it all out and store it. The hopper line for the filter system is still not placed yet, it's not on top. But the rest of it is, this filter system goes all the way around. As I understand it, there are 50, 71 columns. Really? I'm back, and as I was saying, there are 70 one, I believe. My math could be wrong, but I believe there are 71 columns. And of course the columns get deeper, taller, whatever, however many you want to say it. 
the further you go down the stairs. The system back here required all the comparators and the repeaters to make this work. Back here is the workspace which I turned into a tree farm. As you can see here, there are a whole lot of hoppers and a whole lot of chests. That wood farm that I showed you a minute ago, I used it a whole lot to my, uh, chop down forests over and over and over again to get all the wood to build this. Now, like I said, I haven't put in what's going into where yet, so I haven't put the items I want to filter into this, but that is the next step, followed by, of course, getting the item sources for items I want to sort into this monstrosity. For example, one of the things I want to do is my uh, mob farm over there on the other side of the village. I would like to get the output from that over here and I have to figure out how to do that as well. But let me just say that as the sun sets, so does my video. See you next time and goodbye. Yeah.